Giz Army, it is your girl Leslie Trees back at you again with another video, yes. another naturalist hair mm -hmm. video. Oh, well, it's not a hair video, but <laughs> so get ready with me, honey, yes. with the wonderful Slim Roche. Yes, honey, and we're doing the get ready with me where we're getting into all of the tea. You don't want to miss it, but this is part two of one because <laughs> we really delve into some things. <laughs> So if you want to see how we achieve this look and what tea we got into, just keep on watching. Keep watching. <laughs> Y'all ask me why I'm still single, that's why. Mm -hmm. Y'all think I, I got it. I don't. Yeah, I honestly just think I'm just on a different level than, than that too. Age. Like, but you're okay, you two years old than me, so you prime time. Girl, you this is what, and, but also, I also did everything that everybody's trying to do now. I already did it when I was in college. So, everybody getting married, mm -hmm. everybody trying to have babies. I ain't had no kids, but all this other great news. What? got married. No! <laughs> yeah. I did not do that. And divorced. Oh my god. Yes, I was married all through college. Dang, I did not know that. I knew y'all was, you know, a thing thing, but yeah. I didn't know it was that. What? That's crazy. Yeah, oh, so you can give me marriage tips. Oh, uh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it was good. <laughs> so we love it. That's why I think I'm single, because <laughs> I've done all that stuff, and so everybody in here is trying to marry they person they was with after college and all that stuff. Meanwhile. That's very true. Wait, pause. Meanwhile. Your guy's still in my DMs. I don't know <laughs> tell you. That's what I'm saying. I don't know if y'all, y'all don't, I just don't know if I, I, can't, I can't be the one to give it to you. I can't be the one to give it to you, bro. Like. This is what? It's hot. <laughs> Turn on the air. Go <laughs> be fast. <laughs> I'm sorry. Yeah. 
he thick. He ain't used to be thick. You're right. I get what you're saying. <laughs> I get what you're saying. He ain't used to be like that. Yeah. And then, okay. I used to think he was so attractive. But now, you're a no. No man. No man, no man. That lifestyle, that lifestyle, that lifestyle, I feel like is where a lot of guys my age are. Like the lifestyle that he lives. No, the thing is, is half of these look can be showing off for the gram. Boy. Showing off, like they like, doing things. I know you, I know you lost your job last week, <laughs> but I'm just saying, y'all need to stop fretting for the gram because the gram ain't fretting for you. Stuff like that, like kills me. And I, I apologize for my cursing, y'all. If you gotta bleep this out, I'll bleep it. It's okay. Because <laughs> I, I, I'm military, you know. It's just, it is what it is. Promotion. Congrats. Coming up. Yay. Okay. Okay. 19. Keep going. <laughs> but yeah, back to thick men. I don't like me and thick. Like I like that. muscle men. I like guys who are taller than me. I want somebody who can be able to lift me up. <laughs> I like <laughs> men that are like. You ain't got to worry about nothing. nobody lifting you. It's just skinny behind. Yeah, but I, I like men that are like built but not too thick. Because I want to know, like, you know, when you like. And you just not getting your little pooch, it'll be cute for me then. If you right. think now, you gonna be thick, then you ain't got no way to go but fat. Fat, you right. I need my man to have some growing room. But like most of the guys my age, they, they in that still going out of stage. If you go on to college parties, just I'm getting up real quick. Stop. <laughs> Girl, why did I not put the primer on? No. <laughs> You gonna scratch it off? Wait, no, let me use one of yours, girl. I'll waste this. I need to put primer on. <laughs> I feel like this is so red. We just gonna start over. <laughs> I'm gonna start over too. Wait, let me just wipe it off with it. <laughs> Stick I like too though, cause they're like... Where's out your pores? Girl, I think I put too much on. Lord help. <laughs> so first of all, this isn't a mask. <laughs> Y'all don't take no tips from me, okay? I'll be telling you. Don't take none from me. This gonna turn out alright. Y'all, y'all just, just recognize what I went through this about, okay? Listen. Look, look at my face. <laughs> I'm telling y'all, it's gonna come out fine. It works. I swear it works. I don't know what I'm doing, but that's just the primer. <laughs> They're like their health because a lot of men don't like a lot of men hate going to the doctor and I'm not saying you got to be up in there every time you cough or sneeze but you got to like know eating fried chicken every day you gonna have cholesterol right high blood pressure fat fat <laughs> but I've seen like on TV fat people where like they be like no one ever told me I was getting bigger blah 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 oh, no that ain't me I'm gonna tell you I'm glad someone don't do don't matter that. how close we are like I'm gonna if I know you from Timbuktu or I don't know you from the I'm gonna tell you hey you get a little yeah, you getting a little damn I need I need you seeing your college consists <laughs> I'll tell you you getting a little thick man. I came back from freaking um I came back from freaking my deployment girl and I was like 20 pounds lighter. And I looked at that picture of me from college. I said, oh, I ain't tell no friend. <laughs> Cause y'all ain't tell me I got fat. That's the same thing with some people we leave. <laughs> or to leave out. <laughs> or to leave out. <laughs> okay, so we off the fitness. So what else, else, okay. do you, what else do you like in a man? No, you were about to say, what about, what about what? <laughs> like, okay, what about their demeanor. What do you like him in the in a in a guy like? Cause me, like he got to be confident. He got to be comfortable with himself, not fucking insecure. Y'all, y'all guys be out here talking about women are insecure, but no. The reason y'all be out here trying to figure out what the next bra I got going for you is because you are insecure, honey. People don't, who don't know who they are, that's not for me. Cause if you out here like trying to be like everyone else, like right. then. I don't know who you are. Yeah. How you the, how you gonna want me? You. How you gonna want me? Because I don't know you. To love you and you don't even know how to love me. Period. 
and that's a big thing like i feel like a lot of people don't know how to love themselves girl some don't even know what it means they said this about to be a part one on my channel part two on yours <laughs> it's gonna have to be period <laughs> come back to the question because i tell you i'll be all over the place i like men who are confident men who have something going for them themselves but men who are also ambitious like i don't like guys who like you know like lawrence from insecure like he thought he had his sat little thing couch. going but he sat on that couch like no you just gotta be a like a go-getter you gotta be motivational and you gotta be positive a lot of people these days is not positive men and women mm -hmm. don't get you no girl that's not positive because you're gonna be cheating and unhappy period Period. Period. My, my type of guys, yeah, like I said, he has to be freaking dumb, dumb attractive. Like they I got, married. yeah, I gotta be attracted to you. Like married. I wanna like, mm -hmm. like if I think you that fine, like you're not gonna hear the end of it. Right. I'd be like, you're fine. No haircut, you're fine. But on God, let me tell you one thing: you won't be in the mirror longer than me. Period. Cause you got. I'm sorry. You and your mirror, I'm just saying, like, if, but, but like, we're not looking for gay men yeah, to date, yeah, yeah. so it's honest. But if you in the mirror longer than me, sweetie, mm -mm, like that, or guys who are like too extra about getting their pictures, yes, that, that I don't like that. Honey, yeah, no. Like if you doing what I'm doing for a picture, mm -hmm. no. Now you better take all the angles for my picture. You better know how to take. But I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna have you too. But don't be like, no, just let me take because you know I already know what I'm doing. So just let me take a picture. If you not, then I agree. You might be on a side that I don't know. Yeah, I don't. Yeah, my mama always told me don't ever be if he in the mirror longer than you or in the bathroom longer than yeah. you. Cause my mom, yep, yeah, cause my mom was dating this pretty boy, and I was like, "Mom, what happened to?" I can't remember his name. We was like, mm -hmm. I don't know how old. She was like, "Girl, I couldn't do it. He was in the mirror longer than I was." I said, "Oh, okay." Yeah, but attraction is very important. I was um, listening to a podcast. Shout out roommates podcast. <laughs> um, and shout out selfish bag. <laughs> I listened to that one. Okay, shout out. It's the start of show, Pepe. <laughs> um, but they was talking about. Uh, how attraction is important. Like um, this guy, Stefan Bossier was on there and he was saying that attraction is important. And if you're not like, if you lack attraction, it's gonna cause like a lack in other places in a relationship. So mm -hmm. a lack of trust, a lack of respect. Right. And when I started thinking on that thing, I let that thing boil a little bit. And mm -hmm. I was like, that is so true. But you, though. you're gonna put effort into what you're interested in. Yeah. If you're not interested. And like, it's, it takes like people that I'm not that attracted to. Mm -hmm. It takes like, if they send me money for food, like that's not as it sentimental. Would, like it don't was hit. That I if like, it was right? something that I really like, <laughs> yeah. I'd be like, oh my gosh, you know, they done got me something. Yeah. You got me something. You know what I mean? <laughs> but if it was just somebody else, I'd be like, oh, that's nice. Thank, Thank you. you. <laughs> right. Appreciate and it. And keep it moving. For real. Like I need you to look at me like. Like, I'm the most like, beautiful. Like you, you blessed. Way. Yeah, like you blessed. Like you, you blessed me. that we together. And I'm gonna look at you the same way. I swear to God. Like yeah, like you treat me like a queen. My king. And my king. You can sit on the throne. Sermon. You, your <laughs> chair, <laughs> chair is yours. I'll be dazzling that shit for you. Yes. Shout so, out roommates again because <laughs> Stefan taught me. You know, don't have no expectations for nobody because we're all human and nobody's gonna always react or act how you want them to act <laughs> right and so yeah so we know we know him but you know if he does come around yeah. i'll be in jesus be with us hopefully i'm here in <laughs> here and available ready to rock right and when i really think about that thing i was like i'm not ready to be married like i'm freaking 20 at a time like i'm 22 like i got a lot of singleness Right. Dude, I wish somebody would have been like, girl, you shouldn't do this. That I had really was going to listen to. Because honestly, mm -hmm. we just we just knew it was going to like be them. So. Mm -hmm. But I feel like it'd be hard if you was in a relationship like that. Because y'all was together for a long time. But like when you be with somebody for that long, like you, especially like say if I was 16, you, ain't, you don't, I mean, you know who you was back then and as you grew, but not really as an individual and that's the thing it's like you're you're with somebody and y'all are growing together mm -hmm. so you're not really growing as an individual yeah like you just said like so we're growing together but it's it's all these things are happening that's 
it was just stuff we needed to have experienced as adults I feel mm -hmm. that if we had just like I feel like if I, I feel like maybe if we had called it quits in high school or right before, before we went to college mm -hmm. then we might have um you know gotten back together after mm -hmm. college and then things would be different now but yeah I For think sure. that I think that that period of time that that point where college or you're grown and you can drink and do all that stuff is ideal like you, that person especially men they have to go through that yeah they have to because they're not gonna I don't feel like they're gonna do right but well, they don't <laughs> it's yeah. possible now so let me pull out my Kimmy. So we asked on our Instagrams, and if you, you are not following me on Instagram, what are you doing? My Instagram is at Slimmache, and my Instagram is at Wilgis. That's where you gotta spell it out. Spell it out. W2H's, two O's, two A's, G I Z. Period. No period, but that's it. Exclamation. <laughs> <laughs> um, so, yes. So, I asked on my story. You know, who just relationship Q and A's, blah blah blah. Y'all don't be responding. No. So, yeah. Go follow me if you will respond. I'll shout you out. <laughs> I have one. This one says, How do you feel about a poly relationship? Whoa, so like an open <laughs> one? Or not open but like I guess or... like polygamous. More than one. Whoa. Like oh. your man's who was married. Um, I think it might be different if like parties are are like in agreement. But no, okay. he's not. He's not a polygamous. That guy. <laughs> he's not. He's monogamous because marriage yeah, here true. is for one person and another person, not multiple people. But you know, I mean, so each his own. You know, uh, people say that that they don't believe that you know that what that we're supposed to be with just one person on this earth or one person at a time that's why there's so much cheating and blah 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 so i mean if it works for you by all means but me i'm territorial so it's not gonna work for me honey we're monogamous if you don't want to be monogamous then i can be by myself <laughs> period okay so for a poly how do i feel about poly relationships <laughs> Um, I, if you're talking about, you know, like, relationship, relationship, I'm not a fan because I don't, I don't think you could get multiple people all on one accord in that aspect. Yeah. Um, but as far as like friends, yeah, you have a lot of friends, <laughs> a lot of genuine relationships with people. Um, but if you talk about like two boyfriends and a girlfriend or two girlfriends and a boyfriend all in one, like, I don't know. Mm -hmm. I don't think so. Mm -hmm. This girl, she says, I have like two guys that are willing to pursue me and take me down or make, make it known. They go above and beyond, but the problem is I don't like them, capital letters like in any way mm. they're nice but that's about it i'm not feeling it am i wrong for that i just feel like you don't have to settle with every guy every nice guy you meet Dang, two guys you're lucky can you send them my way maybe i like them <laughs> Shall they swing my way? <laughs> so if you don't like them in any way i would subtly and politely friends on them now it depends on where you are in your life if you are a struggling college student and you hungry, get the free food sticks. And then when they try to, you know, move it along, say, whoa, whoa, whoa. It's not the right time. Childish. Period. Let me give you my advice. <laughs> that's how I feel. Like I mean, get the free food if you, if you, that's, that's a bad way to look at it. But I mean, if they're willing to chase you down and all that stuff, well, get the free food. After, I feel like it's, it should be that way. After you express that you don't want to pursue them, or uh, get two it. or three meals, right? Oh my gosh, no! I just want. So you might, I mean, you might just to see if, like, maybe, you know, even though you're not attracted to them, that you couldn't be. 
I don't know if you can really grow attraction, but you might. Yeah, sis, you might. You just gotta tell him. Eat that food and go. And and be be, <laughs> be sweet about it, girl. But sometimes some people you gotta really be like, um, no, because they don't get in the picture. One question. Good job, guys. <laughs> I hey, love I you guys. To. <laughs> One question is, what do you think people, or why do you think people automatically feel entitled to being spoiled? Oh, that's a good question. One, but juicy one. Mm. I, don't, I don't know if we'll call it spoiled, but maybe they just feel like, like they deserve, they deserve what they deserve. And if that's what, how they feel, then they're going to express that. Yeah. However, comma, y'all be, guys be around here like, guys be around here like, I'm going to buy her this Gucci bag, I'm going to do this and I'm going to do that for her. Y'all be setting a precedence for us to be like, yeah, can I get my bag please? Can I get, the, no, I want my fries fresh. Like, <laughs> or if you pretending to be about it, like, similar example if you like on instagram flexing with your money and you bought this money 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 whatever even if it's like designer stuff and it's and it don't phase you then just like city girl said on her interview <laughs> if i ask you to buy me a chanel bag before i go out with you then buy me a chanel bag since you bought it since you bought it a lot of people like try to claim they bought it and they don't be and that's that's, that's a setup. You don't be trying to get set up. But yeah, I just don't feel like it's an entitlement. I, I mean, you're entitled to feel like you should be treated a certain way. But just on the just on the other end of that, if you don't feel like that's what you're willing to offer whoever you, whoever you are in pursuit of, like they telling you this is what I want in order for us to like kick it or be able to communicate, then tell it and move the fuck on. Like I said. Don't be thirsty, cause I will drown you. And I don't, I don't like guys who, who flaunt it. Like, why do I need to know you got money? Like, I mean, I don't, I don't know how to best put that, but like, you can, t you, there's ways in which I can tell you have money without you having to explicitly tell me you got money. Like, throwing, throwing your strip club ones up or, or, up or whatever, or posting a picture in your car with your ones, or buying, showing you got a new car, like. I don't even know. Yeah, I'm not a flashy person. Yeah. But don't let them low key guys fool you, honey. I thought I had me a, a dime top of the line, my mind. Mm -hmm. That was low key. And honey was a whole thought. Damn. It's more like a friendship way. Mm -hmm. What if yo. So I don't know, guys are weird with this, right? So, like, you know your friend, like, is interested in But. I'm not interested in your friend, but I'm interested in you. Oh. What do you do? <laughs> what do you do? Like, what is it? Do you, do you have to take that L because your friend pursued me first? Or do you say, fuck it, like, I like I think you make that call. That's, that's why I say I feel like it's your call. So if your friend, like, I, I go to that person that do like you and be like, yeah, so is so-and-so single? Yeah, but what if we already talked a little bit? Like, we, we are, yeah. I didn't, you know, like, you try to, like. You ain't know. You try to, like, talk to them and y'all didn't to get to know each other like stuff, yeah. right? And then you see this. Oh, that's so it's like, what, okay. That's what I'm saying. I'm oh, like, okay. Oh. It's like, they invite you to watch the game and then somebody fine. Come like, they, they're the one out of the group that ain't the one. Yeah, so, yeah, mm -hmm. that's exactly it. Hey, I just be like, young low, shoot my shot at the one that's fine, at the friend. And then when we once that shot go in, I be like, hey, your friend over there, he used to like me. But they might not even care. I don't know. Some guys don't. Right. We grown. <laughs> so I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you want more collabs with me and Miss Slim Roche, <laughs> let us know. Yes, comment below <laughs> and don't no, forget yeah. to go check out part one of her video because I mean y'all know y'all gonna have questions about this makeup. Period. And I know y'all gonna have responses to that tea we got into. <laughs> yes. 
So make sure y'all go check that out. And of course, follow me on all of my social media. That's W two H's two A's. Excuse me, just kidding. That's <laughs> W two H's two O's two A's G I Z. And then go follow me, Slim Rache at Slim Rache. That's it. Simple. <laughs> <laughs> make sure you guys thumbs up this video for more and sure you guys comment below and don't forget to subscribe to my channel of course and go subscribe and follow Swimmer Shane's channel as well so I will see you guys on my next upload it's your girl Lisa Trees and as my 2019 saying goes protect, protect your peace <laughs>